it's important to personalize treatment in medicine, and even more so when dealing with reproductive medicine, because in this case, we're not talking about just one patient, but at least two, the woman, the man, and the third patient, which is the embryo. It's very important to determine if in vitro fertilization is the best treatment which the patients can undergo, and based on available data, to give a clear indication of the prognosis. In doing this, the patient must neither be given false hope nor be led to expect the worst. An analysis of the couple must, of course, take into account both partners. At the very least, we will ask for a semen sample in order to evaluate sperm quantity, mobility and structure. The woman will need to undergo some simple tests, which are basically an ultrasound scan and blood tests. These are used to determine the state of her ovaries and to also determine if there are any anatomical abnormalities in the female internal genitalia which are the cause of difficulties getting pregnant. Of course, depending on results obtained and health background, a number of additional tests will be carried out after these initial basic tests.